Skin disease and complex wounds account for nearly a quarter of GP consultations, costing the NHS around £5 billion a year. They range from relatively benign to life-threatening, impacting on quality of life and causing significant distress. Recognising the need to better understand the causes of these conditions, our specialist team at the Centre for Dermatology Research is exploring ways to improve diagnosis and care. One of the world's leading skin research centres, the CFDR, brings together clinicians, scientists and psychologists to translate research discoveries into new treatments across four key areas. Psoriasis affects more than 2 million people in the UK and is currently incurable. Our team has been at the forefront of developing a range of novel treatments which are now licensed and used within the NHS. This work has resulted in high-profile publications in major journals. We've also developed the pioneering Psoriasis Rapid Access Clinic, PREC, a service designed by patients for patients. Based on early diagnosis and timely intervention, it redefines traditional methods of working, with consultant dermatologists, nurses and psychologists working alongside GPs in a primary care setting. Through early management, the chance of remission increases, particularly when newer biologic therapies are used. Our team also hosts the Psoriasis Shoutout Roadshow to get people talking about the condition and share a positive message. Photodermatoses are skin conditions triggered by sunlight and affect many adults and children. Symptoms can present after only a few minutes of sun exposure. They have a devastating impact on people's lives, preventing them from going outside during the day and affecting their ability to work. With limited research into the photodermatoses, most patients are still without effective treatment. Manchester is a leading centre for research in human photobiology and the photodermatoses, conducting patient-centred research to identify new targets and therapies. Provoking these disorders experimentally allows researchers to examine their mechanisms of action and predisposing factors. We also work closely with patient and professional organisations to maximise opportunities to engage with patients and the public. At least 80,000 people in the UK have an open, complex wound at any one time. Our team collaborates across the research and clinical landscape, bringing together a range of experts and those directly affected by wounds to undertake high-priority research for the benefit of patients. While many different treatments are available, we identified gaps in the research and are working to better understand factors affecting wound healing to make future treatments more targeted and effective. Hair loss, resulting from inflammation or chemotherapy, can cause distress and poor self-image. Our inflammatory hair loss team has been investigating the mechanisms behind hair loss, such as failure of the hair follicle to protect itself from immune system attack, and find new treatment and prevention methods. We've discovered how fundamental processes at the cellular level can be disrupted in the follicles of people with inflammatory hair loss, and tested new strategies to protect stem cells in hair follicles from chemotherapy damage. We're also studying the side effects of newer, more advanced anti-cancer therapies on hair follicles. Following our All About Alopecia event, linking researchers with patients and the public, we're now working to develop a national disease register for alopecia areata. With the health and social care budget in Manchester now devolved, our researchers have a real opportunity to implement new treatments and diagnostics which could help thousands of people.